But we're moving on to talk to our guests today because he is one fifth of iconic pop group Steps. Um, but Lee Latchford Evans is about to swap dance routines with becoming a dad as he and his wife Kerry step into the next chapter of their lives parenthood. <laughs> Guys, I'm so excited to be talking to you both about this. You must be just beside yourself with joy. We We're really are, very aren't, happy, we? aren't we? <laughs> yeah, very, very happy. <laughs> yeah. So what was it like that moment um, when you realised after everything you guys have been through in terms of uh, trying to conceive that that blue line came up on the stick? Did it? Uh, well, yeah, this is, a, <laughs> this is a bit of a subject, isn't it? I actually had to do three tests to convince Lee that um, <laughs> it was positive. So the first one was a very sort of faint line. Um, <clears throat> I couldn't see it. There was no line. I couldn't, <laughs> couldn't see, it. see it. His eyesight isn't the best, Justin. Um, and I thought, I think I'm pregnant. And um, and then you went, no, no, no. And then I woke, I woke up the next morning at 4 a.m. and um, I did another one. And uh, yeah, that yeah, was the one. Yeah, that, that was the one. There was kind of a fake line on that one that I could see, but for whatever reason, I still kind of didn't believe it. So the next day, Kerry did the third test. And it was a digital one, wasn't it? It was, yeah. That actually said pregnant, so I couldn't really argue with that one. Because <laughs> <laughs> the, the reality is, is you guys have, you know, we've really been through it to, to be able to reach this point. Um, and from friends who've, who've also had IVF treatment, it can almost feel like you don't want to look forward to it too much because of heartbreak in the past. But do you feel like you can really take hold of this and, and enjoy this moment? I think it's, it's 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 quite hard to enjoy it because you you want to be sensitive to friends that are going through a really tough time and obviously we we've been there as well um, but at the same time yeah you you do you know we we've yeah, we've 100%. embraced it you know especially since you know the, the the scans have turned out really well so it's you know it's been yeah so far fingers crossed it's all going well there's 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 a little oh. Oh. So. The second one. <laughs> Smiling. Lee, is it my imagination or every time you're on Loose Women there seems to be some big event in your life? <laughs> yeah, there's a bit of a connection with you guys, isn't there? Basically, yeah. um, going back to when I first proposed to Kerry, yeah. um, we were, Steps were performing on Loose Women doing Deep Shade of Blue, I believe, and nobody knew obviously what was going on in my head trying to perform and thinking, oh. there we are. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> If I forget a move or my lyrics at any point there, it's probably because I'm thinking I'm about to propose, <laughs> um, which is pretty mental. And I think last year as well, that the guys, we were in a hotel um, announcing the album um, from Steps, our new album, What the Future Holds, and obviously the tour that was put back and things like that. And I knew then that Kerry was pregnant and nobody else knew. So we were live on Loose Women talking about, you know, the guys' kids and things like that and what our future plans were. And inside, I'm burning up, and I just really wanted to like shout from the rooftop <laughs> what was going on, but obviously couldn't. So I don't know what it is with you guys. There's always something. <laughs> it's like coming into a confessional or something, yeah. Lee. <laughs> so, so Lee, um, so how? I mean, how did you tell your bandmates? I mean, that must have been a really exciting moment for you. What was that like? I thought you were going to say, "How did it happen?" Then I was going to say, "You don't know that." <laughs> Well, well. Yeah. <laughs> that one for another time. <laughs> no, telling the bandmates was was wonderful actually. We um just like this on Zoom and we were planning the year ahead because as people know we've got a tour at the end of the year this year. Um tickets out on now, they are on sale now. Um and I just held the scan picture up like we've just seen. I just went, guys, I'm gonna be really, really busy and I don't know if I can be there and sort of put the scan up and I said, you better meet somebody. And they all, they were crying, they broke oh. down. They were, you know, tears of joy. There was so much going on and I actually filmed it. I've got a little private video for ourselves that I wanted to show to Kerry because she obviously wasn't there at the time. So she could see the reaction as well, yeah, which so, was really so wonderful, sweet. wasn't it? Yeah, lovely. And it was really good. Lee, you must be excited about going away on tour, but are you feeling a little bit nervous about the fact that you're going to have your new little one and then you're going to be going away? Yeah, and obviously it's nerve wracking for any parent, new parent to be, um, but especially the fact that I know that the tour's happening and he'll only be a couple of months old yeah. and I'll have to be off on the road, which it's going to be really difficult. I know I'm going to love being on tour with the guys as much as I'm going to hate being away yeah. um, from carrying the baby. So I don't know, we'll have to deal with that when it happens, won't we? Yeah, I'll, I'll visit, of course. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> and, and, and Kerry, in terms of both of your families, um, everyone must just be over, over the moon because they obviously must have seen what it is that you guys went through to be able to reach this point. Mm, yeah, I mean... Yeah, I mean, the, the past sort of few years has been really tough. Um, in 2018, Lee lost his dad. Then I lost my mum. Um, lost a pet. <laughs> lost a pet as well. Um, and also during that time, just before my mum passed away, I found out I was pregnant. And then a week later, I lost my mum. So it's it's been it's been wonderful. Obviously, my, my dad's been so, so happy for us. Your mum's been happy, but it's been a bit of a heartbreak as yeah, well. Yeah, we, because... we had four months of, of hell, really, for all that to happen. Two parents, a pet and a baby, um, all within four months. It was it was horrific, horrific time. Um, and obviously, since then, we've we've been trying and trying. And it has been difficult. It has mm. been tough. Um, we've got through it. I think it's brought us closer together. Um, yeah. at the end of the day which is great but we're very proud to have you know my mum and Kerry's dad that are really supportive and yeah, we get on with each other great don't we any yeah. names yeah. in the frame any names oh, we, we do have um we do have some names yeah. but it's, uh, it's top secret oh. <laughs> tell us that like the next time you're on <laughs> Frankie works yeah. for a boy yeah. and a girl just putting that out there <laughs> Don't worry, we'll, we'll email you our suggestions, Lee and Kerry. Yeah, don't don't you worry about that. But honestly, we are all just so over the moon for you both. Um, so, so enjoy the next few months.